This post walks you through a typical mechanical PE exam question in the category of heat transfer. So first, the problem. A counterflow heat exchanger has 5,000 CFM of air entering the coil at 40 degrees Fahrenheit. Water is provided to the heat exchanger with entering conditions of 75 degrees Fahrenheit and leaving conditions of 65 degrees Fahrenheit. What is the log mean temperature difference, or LMTD, if the air leaving the coil is at 55 Fahrenheit? Is it A, 17 degrees Fahrenheit, B, 22, C, 30, or D, 36? The counterflow heat exchanger is opposite of a parallel flow heat exchanger. The cold and hot fluids enter at opposite ends. So the figure shown here shows the counterflow heat exchanger. And notice the directional arrows. In heat exchangers that do not have a phase change, heat is transferred from the hot fluid to the cold fluid through the temperature difference between the cold and hot. However, in a heat exchanger, as shown in this figure, the temperature difference between the cold and hot fluids is not always constant and depends on the location in the heat exchanger. Thus, the log mean temperature difference is used. The LMTD describes the logarithmic average temperature difference between the cold and hot fluid through a generic heat exchanger, either counter or parallel. The LMTD cannot be used for heat exchangers with a phase change like a boiler or condenser, but can be used in this equation. The equation for LMTD is shown on this figure, where LMTD is equal to delta TA minus delta TB all over log the natural log of delta TA over delta TB. Delta TA is the difference in the temperature at the A side, also shown as the difference between T hot out minus T cold in. Delta TB is the difference in temperature at the B side, or T hot in minus T cold out. Let's put it all together and solve for our LMTD. We plug in the delta TA value of 25 degrees Fahrenheit shown here and the delta TB value of 20 degrees Fahrenheit that was found by the temperature differences that were previously identified. Inserting it into the LMTD equation, we get an LMTD of 22.4. So our correct answer is B. For more problems and more information on heat transfer, please visit the website.